Let us together pray the second novena to Saint Clare of Assisi. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Introductory Prayer O Most Holy Trinity, Father, Son, and Holy Spirit, we praise Thy holy name and the wonders of grace Thou hast worked in Thy servant Saint Clare. Through a powerful intercession, grant us the favors we beg in this novena. Above all, the grace to live and die as she did in thy most holy love. Amen. O seraphic Saint Clare, who notwithstanding, living separated from the world, had not forgotten the poor and the afflicted, but had become a mother to them, sacrificing for them your riches and working for them innumerable miracles. Obtain from God for us Christian charity towards our brethren in all their spiritual and temporal needs. Amen. Pray for us, St. Clair, that we may be worthy of the promises of Christ. Let us pray. We pray thee, Lord, Grant us thy servants to celebrate the festival of blessed care, thy virgin, by her intercession, to be partakers of the joys of heaven and coerce with thine only begotten Son, who being God lives and reigns forever and ever. Amen. Dear Saint Clare, as a young girl, you imitated your mother's love for the poor of your native Assisi. Inspired by the preaching of St. Francis, who sang enthusiastically of his Lord Jesus and Lady Poverty, you gave your life to Jesus at 19 years of age. Allowing St. Francis to cut off your beautiful hair and invest you with the Franciscan habit, all through your life, you offered your great suffering for your sisters, the poor Claire, and the conversion of souls. You greatly aided St. Francis with his new order, carrying on his spirit in the Franciscans after his death. Most of all, you had a deep love of Jesus in the most blessed sacrament, which fueled your vocation to love and care for the poor. Please pray for me. Kindly mention your request here. Please pray that I will seek to keep Jesus as my first love as you did. Help me to grow in love of the Blessed Sacrament, to care for the poor and to offer my whole life to God. Heavenly Father, thank you for the gift of St. Clair. Through her intercession, please hear and answer my prayer in the name of Jesus, your Son. Amen. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from all evil. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Pray to Saint Clare of Assisi. Dearest Holy Trinity, Father, Son, and Holy Spirit, we praise you and the fruits of your grace that manifested themselves in your poor and gracious servant, Saint Clair. Through her intercession, we come to you like little children to ask 
that you not only grant us the request in our hearts but also that we may live as Saint Clair did in your heart. Saint Clair, as a young girl, you left everything and gave your life to God and to the poorest of the poor in your native town of Assisi. You were inspired by the words of Saint Francis who pointed you in the direction of Jesus and the most blessed sacrament. We are inspired by your words. The kingdom of heaven is promised and given by the Lord only to the poor. For he who loves temporal things loses the fruit of love. Saint Clair, intercede for us that we may not seek to obtain physical objects but that we may seek the love of God. For we know that temporal objects will not satisfy the needs of our hearts. The longing we feel will only be fulfilled when our hearts rest in our Lord Jesus Christ. Most Holy Saint Clair, we strive to be poor of spirit like you. We strive to be saints like you. We strive to follow the divine will. We strive to trust in the providence of God in our lives. Enter our hearts and make us holy. Glory be to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen.